So between the rain and the snow, we've got a little bit of stuff done on this, more anyway. Center dividers are up, each have their little hole. Now we just gotta work on the back doors that flip down and then we'll get a top on it. Oh, update on this. Got two doors installed. It's off center because it's been warped because of the rain. So I gotta redo those two doors. But it's wired in, fenced in there. Still have the back doors to complete and finish. I have two roughed out up there, but not sure how I wanna connect them yet. And still have to cut the dividers. So we were able to get the four doors installed on the back that will hinge down. Uh, we still need the hardware to lock them up top and stop them from the t folding all the way in. But that's about all we can get done today. Forecast four inches of snow between four and seven inches tonight and it's already 32 degrees so we're gonna call it this morning and go inside. <laughs> Finally not snowing yet. There's a snowstorm expected this the weekend, but I figured I'd come out here and see the progress on the rabbit hutch since we're working on that. We're just glad that it's not snowing again. It's supposed to snow tonight and into tomorrow. But Making a mess. Good. But it got warmer, so we decided to come back. Well, I told them to come back outside. Good. The back doors are done. All right, well let's look. All we need is so it looks two like, letters. so we have kind of this burrow hole part going on. Flipped. It needs to be turned around. This direction? Yeah, you have it like that so that when the staples go in, they don't go where they're supposed to. We have two dividers, we all we need is two dividers, two doors, and the roof. Yeah, these doors are off, so I've got to put spaces in. Got doors on. So, the hope is that this back area will be kind of their burrow hiding place, so they have a safe spot. And then we've got doors back here where, you know, we can peek in for babies and things like that. Um, it's not the perfect solution, but it's going to give us... A place for the rabbits to be where they can still be social and still be together. We've got the chickens over there and our shed. More chickens. Beautiful today. It's not cold. Well, it's not 32 anymore, it's like 38. <laughs> oh, it's balmy. <laughs> Good job. All the way across, okay? What I would do is I'd leave this one right here, 
and then do all the rest. That way, when you do this last one, somebody can hold it and it won't fall on your toes. No, goodness, I don't think I'm cutting this all the way. What kind of cutters are these? <laughs> Somebody. I've always heard them called bullnose cutters because they, they're almost almost a, fl a flush cut, but they're not quite a flush cut. We had somebody ask on one of our videos that we tell what tools we're using. We're not good at doing that all the time. <laughs> and then this is a air nailer, right? Or a staple? That's a stapler. A pneumatic Sta stapler. A pneumatic, pneumatic stapler. Um, and this is just, this is hardware cloth, isn't it? Wire? Yeah, technically it's considered hardware cloth. It's one inch by one inch square. Yeah. Versus the half inch by one inch that we put on the floor for them to pop up. And Roy is so, he's like, well, I'm going to do this and this and this and try to explain it to me. And I'm like, I, my brain doesn't work that way. But he just drew out the plans and did the calculations and all that and made this. That's impressive. Yeah. Three more. Speaking from experience, these are not easy to cut. It's the choir. Like the girls went for a walk. They went to get the mail. It's only a half mile away. <laughs> Quarter mile. Quarter mile. Half, half there, half Don't back. You need that more? Quarter there, quarter back. I know, son. I've got to figure out which, where I need to put hinges first before you can staple it all together. You're like awesome. Now we're putting the hinges in. We just got these at the Big box hardware store. <laughs> and some, what kind of screws are these? These are, they're torque bit heads. And they're, they're decking screws is what they are. And the reason we used, I decided to use decking screws is because they're coated. They're meant to be, kind of have an outside thing. And I should pre-drill all these because it's way easier to get them in. But when you're in a hurry, you do what you do and then cuss later. Yeah, mom's muck boots. They're no pretty. Yeah, they won't be. <laughs> Mine aren't that pretty. They're pretty good. They're supposed to. That's why they're called muck boots. Okay, so let's start. You're going to want to do right there. I'll do this. You just got to line up. Uh oh. So do you see this? So what'd you, you do? Them? You're gonna want to go. I, yeah, right there. When we were doing the chickens, I saw that, and then I put it, I my computer away, and it, and it might have got okay, onto so the we'll place where we put our microphone. Oh, probably. Yeah, teamwork it. Pull the triggers, it's gonna hurt you. Okay, we're done with this. Awesome. On each of these, and then all those little nibs need to cut off. Okay, so you're gonna want to do one right here. Yeah. 
This one, we're gonna have to do right here. And right here. We had four hawks circle around this shit. Really? Okay. Interesting. They probably decided those chickens are too fat. <laughs> Maybe. Alright, we can't get any food there. What, babe? No. It's getting hot. Yeah? Is yeah, that because so you walked all the way, walk way to the mailbox? Right. So right I, right. I know, but is that why you're hot? Okay, so where are those clippers? I don't know. Okay. Done from you. No, not getting from my clothes. I can use those to clean up. And then we clip off the sharp ends. Ouch. <laughs> yeah, that's why you cut them off so quiet you. Mama! <laughs> <laughs> Weird, these aren't cutting right. They aren't cutting right. Probably because they stapled it down. Is it too close to the board? That's what I was thinking. Probably because they got stapled. <laughs> it's really funny. Oh, they're still on scratch and doing chicken right now. Again? No, they're still on corn. The chicks made a mess. There's food all over the place in the laundry room. Uh, that's because Evelyn fed them. There we go. It's only lunch if you eat lunch, right? We didn't have lunch because we had a big breakfast. We had a good farm breakfast. have all the doors on the front and we're trying to get a roof on here that will flip up so we can uh, easily access this area so it should look a lot better when we're finished but we've gotten a lot done today and we're hoping that we can get this done so we can start putting our rabbits in this all right, so we tried to get the one of the lids on, but we'd have to adjust it, and it's getting cold again. So we're gonna head inside, and we'll probably have to do it next week. Hopefully, depends on how much rain and snow we get tomorrow, and the next day, and the next day.